Okay, so we have last but not the least, the RAD model or the so-called Rapid Application Development Model. Ito ay isang uri ng model na kung saan nagpupush ng prototyping and iterative development with no specific planning involved. May planning but not very specific or actually it's not specific. The process of writing the software itself involves the planning required for developing the product. Kita niyo to? Process of writing the software itself. Habang nagra-write ka na ng software, saka pa lang nagkakaroon ng planning. So kakaiba to. Nakikita kagad dito na in in the process of development, in the process of writing the software, there's planning na nangyayari. So paano siya? The rapid application development focuses on gathering customer requirements. Yan o, oh, kumukuha ng customer requirements sa pamamagitan ng workshops or focus groups na mga ano uh, na activities. Yan, nakukuha kagad nila yung requirements ng customers sa pamamagitan po ng ganitong style. Workshops and focus groups. Early testing of prototypes by the customer using the iterative concept or the iterative model. Gamitin or reuse yung mga prototypes na nabuo sa RAD development. I-continuous natin ang pag-integrate at purpose nito is rapid delivery. Uh, masasabi mo na katulad siya ng sa Agile. Kasi sa Agile, there's what you call rapid delivery. Pero di, ang kakaiba sa rapid application is... The, it, focuses, it focuses on speed rather than details. It focuses on uh, reusing existing prototypes rather than creating new prototypes. It exists on uh, more on gathering requirements in this kind of scenarios like workshops aside from interviewing them, let's say, naka-incorporate na mismo yung client dito sa, sa development. Ang RAD ay software development na gumagamit ng minimal planning at favor on rapid prototyping. Gagawa agad ng prototype, then papakita. Then kung magustuhan, then yun nakagad. The prototype is a working model that is functionally equivalent to the component of the product. Yung prototype na nabuo is maaari sabihin natin na if ever na ito equivalent doon sa hinahanap nung client o mismong component ng product na yun, therefore doon makikita na ay ito yung ginahanap ko Mag mabilis yung process kasi buo na kagad yung system in RAD modeling the functional modules are developed in parallel as prototypes and are integrated to make the complete product for faster product delivery yung nangyayaring integration or let's say nakalagay dito yung nangyayari dyan parallel sila side by side yung development nangyayari na rin sa prototyping nangyayari na rin sa mismo planning side by side para ma-develop o ma-deliver yung product na required ng customer in very uh, very fast pace para sinasabi natin dito may mga buo ka na na system tapos yung system na nabuo mo na ang gagawin mo doon is ipapakita mo sa client kung yun yung ginahanap nila o di ibig sabihin no? wala na nga namang detailed pre-planning na mangyayari at wala na rin masyadong uh, pagdadaanan na process i-incorporate na lang na baguhin yung mga gusto pa nung uh, client dun sa existing na prototype na yon. RAD projects follows iterative and incremental model syempre dahil nga iterative na ulit yung na-develop na system gagamitin nyo sa susunod na iterative yung iterative model kasi yung mapapansin niyo yung mga nadidevelop na mga versions no, tsaka yung sa incremental yung mga versions na nadidevelop kasi po doon hindi naman po kasi natatapon yun eh yun ay existing na version 0, version 1, version 2 tapos ini-improve lang from time to time at dito pumapasok yung, ad yung advantage ni RAD no? nagamitin yung mga existing na yun then i-change yun to recycle those program once more i-change siya sa kagustuhan ng ng client. Kaya nga wala nang masyadong planning na nangyayari sa ideal na hinahanap ng client. Kasi kadalasan, clients or customers na nagpapagawa ng software, may mga software na kasi sila na ito lang yung function na gusto nila. Ito yung kailangan nila. So, kung papakitaan mo sila ng specific uh, software or 
or system na may ganitong function kasabi niya oy ito na yung hinahanap ko i think kailangan baguhin nila natin yung design baguhin yung ganito and it will not take a lot of time it is a very fast paced model the most important aspect for this model is to be success uh, to be successful is to make sure that the prototypes develop are very reusable yes ito na nabanggit ko yung prototype na dinidevelop from each iterative and incremental phases sa model dapat reusable functional gumagana to be able to reuse it once more for further development of that uh, system to be used by the client sa pinakamabilis na deployment hour nito o deployment time nito yun yung ibig sabihin ng RAD kaya nga po siya tinawag na rapid rapid application development existing applications are there ipapakita mo na lang sa client at pag naipakita mo na to sa client tatanungin mo si client kung ito na ba talaga yung hinahanap nila feature kung hindi man to yung hinahanap nila feature you can uh, show the client multiple prototypes at hanapin niya yung kailangan na doon with Uh, minimal planning and minimal tweaking nung itsura ng mismong system at para magamit na kaganyan ito in his or her business.